Climate change is a global problem that we all face. For defence, it creates humanitarian crises that threaten peace and global stability. That's why the RAF has set a tough target to reach net zero carbon emissions by 2040. It needs to switch to decarbonising technologies and move to green fuel sources, reducing dependence on fossil fuel supply lines and enhancing operational resilience. The RAF needs to gather evidence for a framework to make decisions and a carbon emissions baseline from which to work, tailor experimentation and monitor its efforts. And as this important work takes place, the RAF must maintain its ability to operate in the most hostile and unforgiving environments. That's why world-leading researchers at Newcastle University are working with the RAF to create its first living lab. It will be based at RAF Leeming in Yorkshire, a multifunctional base where experimentation can take place in a secure environment, but with real people living, working and sleeping close by. Together, we will explore the potential application of lightweight solar technologies, find novel ways to assess the potential of geothermal energy, look at both hydrogen and low carbon emission electrical power as potential energy sources for ground transport, as well as land management techniques for carbon capture. All of these will be evaluated using life cycle assessment to quantify the intended and indeed unintended consequences. Climate change mitigation is needed now. The vital living lab at RAF Leeming will be part of the solution.